Hello and welcome to the Little Crafter Show. My name is Eileen, aka Eileen Little Crafter. Uh, additional information about this show and my podcast show, which is called Arts, Crafts, and Everything in Between, can be found on my website, EileenTheLittleCrafter.com. Alrighty, guys, I figured I would give you a quick little review on something that I bought with my own money, so this is not sponsored at all. <coughs> Excuse me. I got this at, um, in the, excuse me, a eBay store called Charter uh, City. Uh, I will put the link down below in case you guys are interested. Um, so basically, this is a universal uh, i tablet holder, and this is a universal um, smartphone holder. And this is the um, adaptable hand grip. Um, this can go for these particular products, and also. Um, you know, to hold as a selfie stick. So if you want to hold your camera, you know, for your tripod, you know, if you want to use this and that. Um, two out of the three things I don't like, and I will <coughs> explain to you uh, how it's going. Um, so this is how it, it opens up. It doesn't um, turn, so it doesn't swivel. It's just one pretty solid piece. Um, it opens and closes this way. So this is open and then this is locked. So you can adjust it to fit the size of your um, tablet of any kind. It tells you what kind. And this is the universal <coughs> cell phone holder which has uh, a screw here and uh, an adapter here. So basically you can either do it this way let me just do it this way so it can be easier. Or it can screw in me, this way. So, anyways, you get the point. Um, I personally do not like this. My husband had one before. It's called the basic. Um, his I don't think had any rating. I forgot that he had this one, and I was not a huge fan of it. It's really for me hard to open and I'm always scared that this is going to break so I did not like this I like this particular piece and I love this it's a nice handle very sturdy um, as you can see it's very orange and um, it's you know good to the touch um, I don't like to take my phone out of my case which I have to clean my um, phone but anyways you get the point I don't like to take my phone out of my case so this is an otter um, <coughs> And I think this is a success. Yeah, it's a success. Anyways, um, and I'm not crazy about taking my phone out of its case, so it doesn't fit. So if you have a case, you may have to. And you're not worried about being clumsy like I am, you can have to take it out. Now, with that being said, I had to figure out a way how to use, again, I don't like taking my iPad out of its case, so I had to figure out a way. I, um have this type of case where it opens let me kind of show you it opens like this and then it stands sorry I'm trying to give you a, a clean little space so you guys don't have to see my messy table I really gotta figure out what I'm gonna do with this <laughs> table anyways um so yeah so that's basically how it goes so what we figured out was to keep this going um, sorry about that. Oopsie. Press the button. So we would have to. I don't know what you mean by. So we would. Shut it. <laughs> okay. So, anyways, you would have to put it through here. Or was it the other way around? No, it was this way. It was this way. Alright, we would have to put it through here, kind of wiggle it around, or was it, well I forgot how he said, um, I think, anyways, um, kind of, I forgot exactly how he did it, but, um,
and it doesn't attach so you would have to do something like this put it through the hole I forgot how he did it but <clears throat> I just knew, I knew that this was going to happen when I had to try and do it by myself kind of get it through the hole if I can get it through the hole I'll be fine have to get it through the hole, um, mount it on my, what am I call it, put it through, come on, so make sure that this is open and mount it on, this is an old case but you get the point, let me flip it around, Now that I am, looks like I'm secure, pretty secured in, um, I will take this piece and, nope, I'm not secure, I'm not secure, abort, abort, <laughs> okay, put that in, okay, it's pretty much open and now we are clocking it in place, so now that's secure, and I would have to, do, 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 do. I think I did this wrong, um, we would have the, I guess, let me see, let me double check something, no come on, I hate when that happens, okay, um, let me just do this really quick, unlock it, so, um, where's the camera? Where's the camera? So I would have to do, 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 do. um you can see all my messy room. But um Ah, there we go. I knew that was going to happen. Um, we would have to flip it around once we actually get this thing all locked in properly. Oh, there we go. There we go. So, let's try and unlock it and unlock it again. And so you can see the camera set up there. So, that's how that would go. You can see my crazy feeling. Um, you would, sorry that I'm still getting used to this. So, this is kind of like my first impression of it. Um, of how to do this. Then you would take this particular piece and you would go like this. Make sure it's as secure as possible. And then I would have to just mount it onto my um tripod like that. So this is basically um for when I want to go on live uh, with um. Periscope or Instagram or uh, yeah so that's basically let me see I'm gonna turn this thing off that's basically how I would do it so that um there it is that's that button um, um So yeah, so that's um, how I would do it. Um, I, like I said, I have to make sure that this is all in. If you guys want to take your iPads out, you know, that's probably a best thing. Um, for me, I'm not crazy about it because the other thing is, like I said, um, <clears throat> you know, you would have to make sure it's secure. Um, I don't like taking it out of the, the, the holder itself <clears throat> um, because, and I can't even close this. Um, I'm just worried I may break it so um, yeah so that's basically it in a nutshell and then I would have to go through some I probably did it wrong um, I would probably have to actually have to have 
do it show you one more time how to do this but again this is like I said a just a review of it um, I will give you guys an update if I decide that I'm going to take it out of my case um, like I said it's not the easiest thing to do but it's doable and we, we tested it upstairs while we were working with it so um so that is my first impression. I know that it, it's just not a really good impression, and I know that it could be a pain in the butt. But um, you know, you know, it is what it is. And um, so again, it, I'm sure that it would probably probably would work a heck of a lot better um, if I take it out of the case. But even taking it out of the case, it's a real pain in the kudung kudung because it, it kind of sticks. Um, auto cases are really um, durable. As you can see, this one I forgot how many years old it is, but again, um, this is from Charger City. It holds a lot of different tablets. Um, again, I'll give you the link to their uh, website that, so that you guys can check it out. Um, again, I am not sponsored by this. I just this is my first review on it. I uh, did a kind of sort of kind of sort of I did a review on this on my podcast, which is. Um, the art of scrapbooking uh, part two so I figured I would make a video so that you guys can actually see what I am talking about and I would pull if you guys are from my um, podcast I would definitely put a link down below um, for my latest podcast and so that you guys can see you know exactly what I'm talking about and uh, thank you for joining me on my little practice show and thank you guys for watching um, I mean excuse me listening to my podcast Express and everything in between. If you have any comments or questions, please leave them down below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. I know this may need a thumbs down. I need to work on my reviews. Um, or you can always email me at uh, my email address is Eileen at EileenLittleCraft.com. I will put the links down below so that you guys can uh, <coughs> get all that information. And uh, thank you for watching, and uh, bye for now.